Hey, orange one here. So we got a bunch of spiders in this basement here, which are being a huge pain. Um, I think, unfortunately, we're not really able to close the distance on them. So, uh, be able to hit them with the guns, or maintain the distance to be able to hit them with the guns. So it's been kind of annoying trying to fight them with said guns. We're going to leave um, those up here and just try and do melee on them and see how that goes. Uh, we have killed actually a fair amount number of these guys already. Um, if I need to, I'll go for the adrenaline CBM. Yeah, we might want to do that. Um, hold on. Adrenaline pump. There we go, that one's dead. Our head, though, is pretty badly hurt, so I do want to be a little bit careful here. Yeah, can I harvest that? Sweet. Can I just smash them? Yes, I can. Okay, I'm gonna just do that then. I mean, it's gonna be a lot of food to be harvested at all. I'm not gonna harvest it all. Yeah, if you're on that spider web, I think you move extra slow. Which means I get more opportunities for those uh, sweet kills. Nice. Okay, well, it seems to me like things are going pretty well. I'm just gonna smash these eggs before we get surrounded by more of them. We are walking though, getting encumbered though, so that is a little bit concerning, so maybe I'll take a little breather. Um. Yeah, let's, uh, let's just make sure that we've got all those eggs out of the way. It looks like we've got a good chunk of the eggs out of the way. There's some more here. I'm just, yeah, I'm just gonna smash them all. Just not looking to have more of them get spawned on me after we've done a decent job of clearing this area out. There was at least one of them around here. I think there was two... Uh, spiders, yeah. There's two spiders, like, right around here. Oop. We've got both of them attacking us right now. Can I get away from at least one of them? Come on. One notch. There we go. Here we go. Where's his friend? So there's another one around here, right? Not seeing them. Oh, we're cold. Huh. Okay. I guess we're cold. I'm not seeing too much amazing loot in here right now. But the thing is, is that it's oftentimes hidden under these webs. So if we just go through here systematically smashing them, got a pretty, pretty decent chance of finding something good. At least that's been my experience in the past. Like, some of the best items in the game are in these these basements, so trust me, this is well worth the time to do. At least if they haven't changed how the spawn tables work, which they might have done. They've definitely done it before. Yeah, but we're looking like we're okay. Let's just catch our breath back. And can I... how's my head doing? Got yeah, very good. Okay. So there's not really much more I could do besides maybe taking vitamins to really speed up the healing process. Which I am tempted to do. Um, but I'm not gonna go run up to the car to do so. I think that given the fact that we just discovered that we actually have like four times as many bullets as I thought I had, or more, um, that we're just gonna keep on keeping on. If I look at this uh, ruptured egg sac, so yeah, I'm pretty sure that that's not gonna spawn anymore. Kind of weird how you, you can rupture it and then smash it even further. Like, why is that not just done the first time, you know? Okay. Wristwatch. Not gonna pick that up. 
Definitely this one seems to be not proving to be a very fruitful um, spire basement. It's a shame. Because I've gotten, I think, like a power armor helmet, um, some of the advanced like medicine stuff that like instantly heals you. Like a number of good things from around here. I cough heavily. Why am I coughing? Kind of weird. Random military grade bullet. Okay. Sure. Yeah, this is looking like if I haven't found anything at this point, I'm feeling like we're not going to. Because I think the items are, they spawn. I've at least found clusters of like good stuff and like locked gun safes and stuff. Yeah. That's a shame. At least we killed a bunch of spiders. <laughs> um, let's get our guns back. And I suppose we just kind of loot things out now, huh? Been saying that we were going to do that for a while now, so I think that it's an appropriate time to do so. And we have to heal anyways. So yeah, we'll, we don't really need that on right now. Enhanced memory, I'll keep on because we are probably going to have to do a little bit of combat around here. Um, yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm even looking for right now. I think I was trying to find like gallon jugs and stuff. Hopefully finding gallon jugs of uh, cleaner and whatnot. No jugs. Um, yeah, I'm not really sure. I think just kind of looting and making our way over is probably a good move. Just, you know, there's, there's loot around here. I've cleared out the enemies, essentially, already. So it would be kind of wasteful not to um, at least loot these places. And I'll get like free power, like that fa thing I just found, right? With the flashlight. A little bit of free battery power. Um, also, keeping an eye out, because sometimes there's like gun loots that spawn there pretty good. Um, of course, I don't have anything that will open this, so I gotta smash it open. Okay, we're not having much luck with smashing it open, never mind. We're not going to smash it open. It didn't have like much, if anything, really of value there. Um, I could go down to there. I think, because I'm out of breath, I'm going to just go here and then go to the car. Yeah, these are all bolts already. Yeah, I vaguely remember running through here with some zombies. Yeah, now that this rings a bell. I'm coughing heavily. I don't know what that's about. I don't remember breathing in smoke, but it looks like our character's not happy about something. Um, I've already looted this place. Okay, yeah, so we should probably move forward then. <clears throat> Where's my car? There? Okay. What did I put on the note here? Cable charger? And spiders, okay. Yeah, I think we can move a little bit further into the city. I think east and then south. Sounds like a good plan to me. Okay. What's up? Okay, alright, sorry if that's kind of a weird cut. Um, we were going up here, yeah, because we're going to end up going a little bit east, right? There's like all these houses around here that we haven't really looted. Okay, so let's just slow it down for a little bit. Um, turn off the aisle lights. And shut down the car. And yeah, let's um, deal with that zombie. The loner, so I can go melee. 
There we go. Easy. Super easy. Oh look, there's actually a couple of zombies there, just up there. Before I dive in... Let's just make things just a little bit less intense. And then maybe also loot this house. I don't know if this place I already have looted, because it looks like... I might have passed through here. Not really sure. But yeah, these... These houses could have some really good stuff in them, so I need to remember not to overlook them. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that I've already been in that house. It looks like it. All the doors are, like, open and everything. Um, that was weird that we only picked up two there. I might have hit the button, too. I kind of feel like I didn't. Um, oh, yeah. Someone... Trying to sail to Canada. Okay. Interesting. Little flavor text there. That's weird. That wall has like all this copper wire in it. That must be new because I don't remember that being in game. Looks to me like there's a number of things going on kind of weird with this house. What is that? Is that a new tile? Yeah, that's a new tile for the sauerkraut. Um... I feel like it's completely unnecessary and therefore I shouldn't do it. I'm curious about, um, what is this? Open Palisade Gate. I'm curious about these houses just north of here because it looks like there's not really many zombies around here. Um, there's some huge boomers there though. They're gonna boom on me if I'm... Not careful, let's just... Because I have the bullets, I'm not taking any any risks. And then, because of that, probably, yeah, there's probably some other ones around here that are gonna... ...be intrigued by all the noise we're making. Yeah, there's a necromancer right there. Luckily for me, the things that I was fighting... Um, See, zombie dog, are you gonna actually? I think they're hitting each other, I'm not sure. Oh, hold on. I just got impaled. Not cool, man. Not cool. I don't remember turning that off, that was kind of weird. Um, I can get away from you, that'd be nice. And I'm totally confused, so that's going to be kind of a problem. Um, yeah, you're just going to be... We're not going to be able to get away from you. Let's just shoot you then. Okay. I really shouldn't be wasting bullets like that. That was pretty bad of me. Pretty irresponsible. I mean, I could really be using the coil gun on something like them. Yeah. Let's go ahead and actually do that. Get the coil gun out. We'll just blast them from a distance. And the coil gun's not going to do a lot of damage, but they don't really have a lot of health, you know. Um, stop running. And get the gun back out. I know we got a juggernaut coming our way, but honestly, with the gun that we have, I'm not really worried about juggernauts. They've kind of stopped concerning me. I mean, he could still smash me if I'm not careful. Yeah, like right now. Like, he could really just end this character. Really, I ran out. Um, just drop it for now. I'll have to remember mag the magazine's right there. Okay, I might want to use this car as cover. Okay, that thing's down. Devourer's down. That wrestler is not going to be much of an issue. Uh, let's go ahead and walk just for a little bit. 
just you know get a little bit more maneuverability yeah louie i know it sounds bad but trust me it's fine what is that that's coming over there oh it's just a weakling nothing to be worried about <laughs> easy one. Um, how are we doing? Still got a little ways to go, huh? Alright. That's fine by me. Oh no, we're losing our hearing. Okay, there we go. Go down. Oh, hold on. Stop smashing yet. Uh... Yeah, stop aiming. He's grabbed you. Oh no, he actually threw me. I'm gonna shoot you from lying down then, buddy. I should have been more careful. I kind of knew that that might happen. But to be honest with our head, the way it is, we really need to be taking it more careful anyways. So I'm actually okay with that. That guy got pulled. Um, and then there's this one up here as well, right? Those a couple other bodies. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and reload. Like I said, we have the ammo. And let's go get our other magazine, which we left on the ground somewhere around here. Here we go. Need to reload that and get that in our leg pouch. Which actually, how's the leg pouch doing? That's a little cut up but it's fine it's not cut up to the point where i'm gonna actually repair it but you need to keep an eye on it cool yeah nosh is uh he's he's gone to the point where he really does feel a little bit like doom guy he's just like ripping and tearing through zombies you know <laughs> which have you guys seen um I feel like I talked about this in the last episode or not. I'm not sure because I saw it recently. Um, the Doom Guy Isabel pairing. And I had no idea who Isabel was, and I looked it up, and oh my gosh, I love the internet sometimes. That's so funny taking the Animal Crossing character, making them BFFs with Doom Guy. Okay, this is the house that has the. Um, Bible and American flag, yeah. Um, is that the one that sometimes has explosives in it? I feel like it sometimes has explosives in it. I'm not sure. Um, hold on, I'll be right back. All right, I have to uh, babysit the cat. <laughs> She's been being bad, and so I had to bring her into the room with me. Do it. We would leave my wife alone. Um, so here we go. Uh, what is that? That's kind of weird. We'll put poncho just on the floor. Okay. Yep, not really anything. Hydrogen peroxide. I think it is a disinfectant. Our torso has the bandages. That's yeah, good. I'm not going to replace that. Not, not really worth it. Okay. Check this place out. Kind of loop through the building. And there's some string right in here. That's probably worth picking up. Um, we don't need the sewing kit though. Actual kit. Or this flashlight. I don't know. We picked up this other flashlight. And I can turn this off. We don't really need that on right now. Oh, is that an electric guitar? Oh, sweet. Oh, man. I think we're going to have to wield it. And you can't really plug it in. Uh... Let's go ahead and activate our multivitamin. And we'll make our way back down towards the car, I think, at this point. Zombie master. Where's the master at? Okay. 
Should we fight the zombie master with an electric guitar? They are fighting the acid ants as well. Could be a pretty epic thing they were about to be a part of. What is going on over here? Yeah, I'm gonna start playing the electric guitar. And... <laughs> nah, I thought we were gonna get to fire the turret here at the zombie master. I don't think that's gonna be the case. Zombie master, I kind of am curious to see if I try and melee him with an electric guitar, how this is gonna go. Um, ripped further. Okay, we did one damage. As cool as this is, it does not seem to be effective. Let's get some distance between us, please. Can I not get away from him? Uh, stop playing this. Can I... And if we're, if it's forcing us to do melee, I think we have to go Jane and just drop this. Uh-oh. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. That was, uh, that's actually a much more of a challenge than I was anticipating. Okay, our head health is really low right now. Like, to the point where I am not comfortable even really being out of my car. Yeah, we need to take it easy at this point. This is, this is bad. We'll just kind of hang out, let the blob go away. Um, and we're right here. I'm gonna just check it. Okay, yeah, they're both unloaded. Okay, well, let's go away from the Hulk. And whatnot. And we'll come back down towards the car. Is that earplugs? Yeah, it is. I don't want to get that for our friend. Is that a nail bat? Nail board. Um, check this out really quick. I don't think there's got to be anything super useful in here, but never hurts to check. Um, the gallon of bleach. Nope. Maybe. We're just not getting lucky with that stuff, it looks like. Okay, there's something coming through into the house. Uh, what do we have in here? Some gummy vitamins. I will take that. Okay. Uh, that house is a bust as well. Pretty sure we looted that. I just didn't mark it. Just looted. Okay, uh... And then there was that house. Yeah, it was just that construction. That's why I didn't mark it as looted, because it didn't really even loot it, because there wasn't really anything to loot, you know? Oh, look. The chicks in the house here. Um... The lye powder, we can use that to craft mutagen. We're kind of at that point in the game, so I have to go for it. And tomato, lemon drink mix. I will take both of those. I love me some lemonade in real life. So whenever I see that in game, I feel like I have to pick it up. Um, how was uh, the neighborhood right now? And there are some pretty nasty zombies over there. Ones that I would rather not fight, and one of them is coming our way. It looks like he's seen us. Yeah, he's seen us. He's coming here. Let's get behind some of the slime. Get the proper gun out. I don't see him, though. He's he's taking his time getting over here. He is kind of coming through a couple different houses there, though. There is that as well. Hello, friend. Um, we're peckish thirsty and our head is like caved in, so yeah, maybe we could, um, yeah, we're also in moderate pain, that is a problem. Let's turn this off and this off, just for now, 
and we'll read a little bit. Yeah, we're going to be in a lot of pain because we have our head mostly... It's closer to being us being dead than um, anything else. We're still coughing heavily. Yeah, I don't know. I think we must have, like, breathed in smoke or something. Okay, we're no longer in pain. Good. We're still coughing heavily, though. I forgot my flashlight off, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I do. Well, it's it's too dark for us to be able to read. Um, or, oh, wow, we're at exhausted. We're about to pass out, then. So, hold on. Yeah, stop reading. Close those. Turn on the aisle lights. Um, we might as well because we're gonna have to sleep for a while. Might as well see if we've got any water around here. Um, we do have the water purifier, at least. Okay, yeah, we're gonna need to uh, do a little bit of inventory management and whatnot, is what I'm thinking right here. Um, and I'm kind of looking at it, and we're getting near the end of the episode, so... Yeah. Probably just gonna do a little bit of inventory management and things at that point, you know? Um, all that away. Do, sure. Okay. Do I have water? Water purifier. What about a jug? Yes, we've got plenty of jugs. One to the north. Get that, and I'm gonna try and fill that up with water. If I try and reload it, can I? No, I think we want to go through the siphon. Oh, the water's frozen. Oh. <laughs> okay. That is interesting. So I think. Does it less use frozen water? It does. So we can boil it from here. I think we need to do that. It's going to take some time to do so. I think we need to do that. And if we pass out on the floor of our car, that's okay. I just would rather not be dehydrated when we're asleep, you know? Just get that all the way so that we're full all the way. Pour the rest into this gallon jug. Yeah. That sounds good to me. Um... And, yeah, we should probably just let our character go to sleep here and save the game. Yeah. Well, I'll probably just let this go until we naturally wake up and then have you join up with us either when we wake up or when we're healed enough where I'm feeling comfortable going out, out into, into the open and fighting, you know. We'll see. Um, in any case, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.